So, uh, we're wondering what Brent brings you to Casuera. How'd you get involved? Um, my wife's actually going on the trip, oh, which nice. is fantastic. So, yeah, Aaron, Aaron McIntyre now oh, okay. is, uh, is, is going to help change the world in that little way, which is so exciting to me. It's nice to, you know, I've, I've been really busy, so it's nice to have my wife. Sure, honey. There she goes. Change the world. But, um, yeah, so I'm, I'm, I'm here helping her and helping the, helping the, um, the whole group try and get it happening, which is exciting. Oh, fantastic. Yeah, um, cool. Well, the key thing about Casuera is it's big about supporting education and kids being active. Mm. Was there someone that inspired you as a kid or younger to get... Yeah, no, we were, I, was, I was lucky. In, in my school, we had a lot of... Um, Opportunities to meet various Australian, um, you know, talented people, people that were very good at sports or very good at arts and things like that. And there's something about seeing the place you might want to be one day that can inspire you and, and help you, you know, really feel like you can achieve your dreams. And that's, you know, obviously in, in some parts of the world that's very hard. And it's, it's a dream that's hard to feel like is accessible. But um, it's just it's just nice to have a have a group that want to reach out to some of the less fortunate kids and, and, and really try to try to do something to change their lives for the better, which is great. Right, give them a hope, give them a direction, something they can reach for. Yeah, just yeah, give, yeah, exactly. Give them a little give them a little goal that they can they can achieve, and and, it, and hopefully teach them some great life skills and things like that, which is great. Nice. Yeah. Is there any charities up, uh, beyond this one that you support as well that you like to plug or? Yeah. Oh no, in a, in, a, in a minor way, I like the, I like the, there's an MS to charity like the MS Readathon in Australia because I. I had, a, I had a partner once that had MS, and I, I still think of her all the time. Because that's that's a difficult thing. But so, it's, and also, oh, of course, um, uh, oh god, that's what now. Um, Helen Holman has a has a vision clinic that she she runs biannually, which is a, a fantastic cause for a lot of disadvantaged kids in LA to who might be struggling at school and, and things like that. Thinking that it's something to do with them, but it's just simply that they can't see properly, and they, well, they haven't been prescribed glasses. So she prescribes them, where she can get them prescribed glasses, and it can change their whole lives, which is fantastic. Right, save, save their whole life just from a paradox. Yeah, I mean that's it's it's one of those cool things that when you get handed an opportunity like I've got, and many other people here have got to, you know, have a presence in the world beyond your small little circle. But, Hopefully, get a message across, and, and, and it's nice to see people like like my wife and, and, and like Ellen really utilizing that in such a wonderful way. And me, I'm, I'm hoping to find that that thing that I can actually represent my own two legs. But the, for now, this is a fantastic charity. Oh yeah, it's, it's great. Uh, and for Spartacus, we all watch Spartacus. It's amazing. Great. I just want to mention that how much we loved it. How about anything? Uh, any uh, stories or, or, or what's coming up with the Hercules? Oh yeah, yeah. Like well, we, yeah, no. Well, we just did Hercules. It's still being released around the world as we speak, which is kind of exciting for me, which is, uh, and Spartacus, oh god, I mean, I've got a thousand stories about Spartacus. I was living with, with Caesar for a while, which made some of the fans very confused. They're like, how, how can that happen? Um, it's 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 nice for us in the post-Spartacus days to have such great friendships, because now that I'm in LA, we're all still buddies, which is great. Like, I, I see Agron, uh, I see Dan, and I, I, Todd's coming back over, and Helen, who's Saxer, and Steve, who is, who is the Egyptian, all, all these wonderful people that I managed to, to, to meet in that pivotal time in my life. And to stay friends. And they're all in town. So many are in town. It's great. It's it is really cool. It's like a ready-made network of people, do, so you don't have to sit in your room going. Oh. Yeah, you it's find great. something to do. It's fun. It's really cool. Well, I appreciate you coming over, and we'll, yeah, we're looking for more different. Great. Well, thanks for supporting this as well. It's really great. I appreciate it.